Uh oh. Oh! <laughs> awesome! <sighs> okay, so yeah, we need power, and I think also it might be a good idea to get into, um... What are the machines called? Thermal... Expansion. That's what it is. Thermal expansion. Like, this stuff, this kind of, like, basic stuff we should probably get started on, right? Like... Right. Alright. Uh... <laughs> God. <laughs> Trying to remember how to... Right. Okay. Just trying to remember how everything works. <laughs> it's like riding a bike. If that bike... Suddenly grew legs. Overnight. Yeah, Minecraft is like one of my favorite games. I love it. We're gonna build a turbine later too. Oh. I usually avoid the turbine in Applied Energy Sticks. <laughs> but maybe we should. One short. That's fine. We have an entire smeltery full of stuff waiting to be used, so. We could actually make this taller even if we wanted to. Which I kind of want to. <gasps> oh my god. <sighs> okay, the exploding noise and shooting the thing out of my hand was way unnecessary. That scared me so bad. Alright, so... Cool. What if we make our, our basement floors out of this? I like it. Or would that be I think it'd be too much maybe if it's like the whole floor is that. Um <clears throat> I'm just trying to find a solution that doesn't have us It's going to take a really long time is all that I'm saying. Uh I think I'm just going to do what I was doing before. But maybe we want to use Something with a subtler pattern. What does it look like if we don't chisel it? Maybe we should just use this. It's basically stone, but it's just darker. And then we can make the walls something fancier. I think like it needs to be a, one a different material so that it is obvious that you didn't... Like if I just built my base right here... It's obvious that it's like, you know, you just dug out a cave and that's it. But this is like, okay, you actually put, you know, some another, effort into I it. I got so another one of those swords too, if you want it. Um, yeah, I just don't love, I don't love the way this is right now. Yeah, that's like, we would have to make, it would have to be a lot of these lights. If we were going to do that, like we would have to put one like there, there and there, I think, right? Do we only make we only made one gray one? It would have to be like every sand as well. Yes, all of the things that can fall, guys. Alright. Whoa, what the fuck? Oh my god, what is going on over here? Alright. <clears throat> Which way did Lexi go? Do you guys know where she is? She's not on my minimap, is the thing, so or I just discovered blood altars. Wow. Oh no. Oh, I see. Yeah, I don't see her. Well, I don't know if I even would be able to see her. Alright, she's at 100, 1100, which is um, over here. She's right about in this orange area. So, so Y36. Okay. This is sand. Oh my god, this is the most annoying place for her to be stuck. I dug a hole from the surface into your mineshaft, I think. Into what? Into your mineshaft. 
I is see the one torches. I'm in now or the one by my base? The one that you're in now. Oh you can see God. me on your minimap. Rescue me! Yep. You're above or below me? I can't see you. See, you look at the minimap. See you in the oh, I see you! I was like looking to see if you were close though. Hello! Hi! I mean, there's a lot of resources down here <laughs> if you want to like go mine, but I want to go home. Thank yeah. you. <laughs> <laughs> You're taking, a hero! Taking this iron, dude. <laughs> oh, my oh my god. She wasn't even that far down. She could have just dug up. Uh, thank you. Should we go to Loo Mountain? I'm scared. Where's Lexi? Oh, she's here. She's not in the... That big Loo Mountain scares me because it's gigantic. Hi. Hello. I like her glasses. Thanks. <laughs> I have a present. I gave you a present. You gave me a present? Mm hmm Two presents. Ooh! Ooh! Is that a crossbow? What no. is that? Okay. Uh, so there's a hammer. And then there's a pickaxe. So the hammer, um... Do you have, like, a mine nearby? Or something? Yeah, this way. Just, like, threw that. What? I don't want it. Get out of here. Did you mean to throw your iron axe? Yeah, it's fine. Okay, I don't... I don't want it. <laughs> okay, so what do I do with this? Uh, just point it at the ground and mine, wherever you want to mine. So that's the pickaxe. So get the hammer. Oh, that's a paw. Oh, yeah. <laughs> What does the pickaxe do? Is it just like mines all It's just at once? one. Um, it's just one block, but it's better, and it'll mine diamonds and stuff. Um, and then, basically, it has an XP level, so it'll level up as you use it. And you can use the sharpening kits that I gave you to fix it in your inventory wherever you are. So it'll never, you'll never like get rid of it completely. You know how like right now your regular pickaxe it'll just break and that's it. Yeah. Um, that one just as the durability goes down. And it'll show you on the hotbar uh, the durability. So as it goes down, um, it'll just like stop working. But you can repair it wherever you are with that uh, sharpening kit. Yeah, oh, thanks. You're welcome. Loop Mountain, here we come. We need coal. We need redstone, and that is just the easiest way to get it is going to Loop Mountain. So, okay, what is the Tower of Obsidian with the like blue block at the top? That's something bad, right? I'm scared. I don't remember what that is. I think it's just decorative? Okay, I don't know. That's what I'm asking. Oh, look at all that lapis. What is that? I hit it. Fuck you. <laughs> it's dead. I don't know what that was. <laughs> Whatever it is, it's dead now. Oh, the spider is trying to get to me. He knows. Oops, stuck. Um, <clears throat> it would be really good if we had like a quarry to come over here and just quarry out the whole mountain, and then you don't have to fight the mobs at all. But what? Seriously, dude? You're so far away. Just trying to swoop some of that cobblestone that I dropped. In the meantime, just aggroing everyone. Okay. My inventory is full. Super full. What are you doing up here? This is my spot. Oh, okay. Well, that was a little bit of an overreaction, but... Oh! I just found a beetle that shoots fire! Oh no! I'm on fire. I wonder if that's what I was talking about. Oh god, will, I, will the fire go out? Oh my god. Okay, I'm fine. Holy shit, I was not expecting that. No, this is a Twilight Forest thing, and it just destroyed me. There's, there's a, 
a person in my basement. <laughs> that was really not what I expected. <laughs> okay. We need to go mining. So we need to establish where we're going to build our mine down here. And I think we could just go this way and down that way because this is like a mountain. So I feel like that's a good direction to go. I need to be around level 7 so we gotta go pretty far down because I'm at 54 right now. Because this is gonna be like kind of a, not a permanent mine, but this is the mine under my base that we're gonna probably come back to frequently. So we don't want bad things spawning in here while we're gone. Okay, I'm trying to find a spot that I could mine straight down without falling to my death, but your water. Um, we we're at nine. We've been finding a lot of nickel, so maybe this is a good spot to start like strip mining. But um, I hear the water in front of me, so I'm trying to figure out. Which way is best to go? I guess we could just go this way and see what happens. God, nothing makes mining more annoying than running into a bunch of gravel. There's a giant pit of lava like right in here. And I don't know if we're above or below it. I'm gonna assume we're below it because we're at level yeah, 13. Be it. Okay, uh, let's see. This thing. This button is really sick though, that's cool. That's a cool feature. Okay, and then we need to make this guy Electrum. Wait, I have a block of Electrum somewhere, right? I, th I think. I'm pretty sure I made it by accident, yeah. I made it by accident at the old house. And then we moved. Okay, so this, this, that. Give me this guy. This, this, that. Easy peasy. Energy cell, basic. Cool. Energy upgrade. So this would be the first one, I assume. Bronze gear. Four bronze ingots. Bronze? Hell yeah. Okay, so... um, I assume... Magnetic dynamo. And then that's electrum. Fuse quartz, we need the... Alloy smelter or something like that for that. Okay, so we can start with this and then we can put the dynamo there. And then we could put more than one dynamo if we want to. But we'll start with this one. And then um it's only yeah, that doesn't store like a whole lot. Oh no, it stores two million. That's this is different. Okay, this is the input and output. Okay, so then we take this guy, right? And then um Put this one here, because we probably want to put a pulverizer there, but we'll get to that. Oh, uh, I just want to see if this works the way that I am remembering it. Do we have to put an item deck here? Like that? That doesn't connect. Oh, maybe it's just the thing that we have to click on the bottom. Yeah, there we go. Okay, cool. And then this is filling up. Hell yeah, we got power. Guys, we got power. Kind of. This thing doesn't have power. You don't have power because of... What? Set the energy cell output. Energy cell output. I don't know what that means. Wrong output on cell. Oh, on this guy. Okay, so this is in. Whoa. In. What does orange mean? Oh, orange is out, and then the other one is nothing? Is this empty? I don't know what this this color means. Okay, cool. I kind of wish it didn't have that little yellow icon because it makes me think that there's something there. 
Okay, cool. So, um... If we wanted to automate it more, we could set up a pump in the nether and an ender tank in the nether to transport the liquid transdimensionally. <laughs> um, but we're not going to do that tonight. 